Welcome to the 30th Annual Egan High School Senior Academic Awards Assembly. Certainly the word assembly is being used rather loosely here because I'm standing in an empty auditorium, 700 empty seats, but I'm on the stage at the podium as I normally would be opening this ceremony. I'm hoping that gives it some sense of normalcy as we had to switch to a virtual academic award this year, but we do feel it's very important to acknowledge the accomplishments of the class of 2020 in academics while at Egan High School. This class has shown remarkable resilience, determination, dedication, and acceptance of change. That is very difficult to learn those lessons and proceed with life. We know that they will go on to do great things. Recently, actor Tom Hanks referred to them as the chosen ones. It's a nice way of looking at it. You are the chosen ones. You will be bringing our country back. You will be bringing the economy back. You will be moving into your college education, your military careers, your workplaces, and all the things that you hope to do in your future with a sense of recovery. And I know you can do it. Egan High School has prepared you well to be citizens of the world. You are exemplifying that every day with your actions. Today, however, we are pausing to look at your academic achievements. Throughout the slideshow that you're about to see, you will be seeing names and awards. The awards are typically explained on the screen so that you understand what they mean. And I hope you join us in celebrating your classmates. Now we go on to begin with the students of the year, our seniors who have been chosen by departments as their senior student of the year for 2020. Thank you. Hello, I am Stephanie molstree Cost, Department Coordinator for the Art Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Brianna Wilkins as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Paul Kovac, Department Coordinator for the Business Education Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Brittany Che as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Michelle Lehman, Department Coordinator for the Counseling Office at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Anne Kozlowski as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Noah Mass, Department Coordinator for the English Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate William Altier as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Rachel Fair, Department Coordinator for the Facts Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Sarah Thiessen as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I'm Kathy Gillen, the Department Coordinator for Math here at EHS and we are very proud to congratulate Evan Blom as our Math Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hi, this is Brett Benson and I am the Performing Arts Department Coordinator at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Instrumental Music Student of the Year Jake Barron and Vocal Music Student of the Year Mia Scott for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Holly Loeffler, Department Coordinator for the Health, Physical Education, and Safety Education Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Cole Gibson as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Kevin Dirksen, the Department Coordinator for the Sciences at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Luke Anderson as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Todd Carlson, Department Coordinator for the Social Studies Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Max Meekin as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Chris Barnsworth, Department Coordinator for the Special Services Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Andrew Ellingson as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. 
Hello, I'm Ryan Howenstein, Department Coordinator for the Technology and Engineering Department at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Braden Jones as our Student of the Year for Class of 2020. Hello, I am Janelle Graham, Department Coordinator for the World Languages Program at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Tatiana Pareda as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Jen Gustafson, Department Coordinator for the Work Experience Program at Egan High School. We are proud to congratulate Grace Baltasek as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020. Hello, I am Dina Thorson, an EL teacher at Egan High School, and we are proud to congratulate Angela Nieto Galicia as our Student of the Year for the Class of 2020.
Congratulations to all of our academic award winners. Now I'd like to introduce Ms. Sandra Setter Larson, our Assistant Principal and Athletic Director for acknowledgement of some special athletic awards. This has been a time of uncertainty. The road we envision traveling has changed and will likely continue to change. The things we took for granted, we now don't. There has been and will be grief before the end of this crisis. I feel lost in not watching our athletes on the field, on the court, and on the track. I miss seeing them be great teammates, and they miss playing. But we will, be, we will play again. We will rise from this. There will be goodness and play in our future. It is time to dig deep in our souls and rely on those character values that we have learned through our activities. We need to be good people and good neighbors in the face of our fear. When used correctly, sports can teach us courage, kindness, responsibility, humility, teamwork, perseverance, and empathy. It can help us understand that the most important thing is that we are part of something greater than ourselves and we have a place to belong, to be our best, and to excel. Those character traits help us be bigger on the inside than on the outside. We must embrace what we have learned in our activities. I am proud of all of our athletes at Egan. It is an honor and a privilege to work with all of our programs. I want to give a special shout out to our spring coaches and athletes. They have had a season without a scoreboard. My heart still hurts for all of them, especially our seniors. Missing the, that part of the game is so difficult, but our purpose in athletics is greater. When we define success in education-based athletics, we learn that our goal is to win, but success and our purpose is when we learn lifelong character lessons, build lifelong relationships, and create lifelong legacies. Class of 2020, you are and have created amazing legacies. It is unbelievably beautiful what I have seen from you this spring. Our athletic teams have gathered together in different ways this spring, doing virtual workouts, team meetings, taking on team and individual challenges, book studies, and more. They have learned many lessons, and they continue to be teams, and I am so proud of that and so proud of how they have cared for each other. Team is not defined only by the scoreboard, and this, team, this spring has proven that. What a gift and a blessing in life to see this perspective. And now we have been given an opportunity to be so much wiser and better in the future. On behalf of the athletic department, we will now be presenting year-end athletic awards. Congratulations to all of our recipients. Let's go Wildcats. We love and we miss you. Once again, congratulations to all of our academic seniors, our juniors who had special acknowledgement, and the athlete seniors who were acknowledged. We are very, very proud of all of you, and we hope that this ceremony, although virtual, has given your family and you reason to celebrate. We know that you're going forward, class of 2020, and we just need to let you know we're behind you. Stay strong. We are Wildcats. Mm -hmm.